What is going on, dudes? I am Dave Ralph Duck, and uh, welcome to the prize portion of the three block challenge judging here on the Infinite Heights Minecraft server. I hope you guys are doing all right. Thank you for joining us. I have with me, as always, Slick77. What's up, girl? I thought you said the real duck. What's up, girl? Oh, man. Today is a struggle for us here. Anyway, uh, whatever. So, Slicks and I took a break. We figured out uh, who we think should win what prizes. Some of which you heard. Ha <laughs> ha If you're watching the, you're watching the stream, oopsie diddles. Anyway, uh, so we figured that out. You have until we are done handing out the last award, which is actually first place, to cast your vote for the player choice award um so do that again it's pcv it's slash pcv space vote space plot number to make that dream a reality first place prize will be denoted by a diamond block which is here the second place will be a block of gold which looks like an astronaut helmet for right now because it's halloweenus third place block of iron we have five honorable mentions for this many builders but as the rules state if slicks and i see enough exceptional builds we are at liberty to at our own discretion hand out additional honorable mentions so we will actually be giving out six for this build challenge uh and then the player choice award is a hay bale because i think that that's funny so Get that player choice voting in uh, AFAP as fast as possible. So without further ado, the honorable mentions. We'll start here with Reese's. If I can unvanish Reese's, um, we see a lot of really incredible animal, snake, and dragon designs. And this is another one of those Reese's. We love seeing this. We love the little twist that you put on it with the oranges they look adorable this little cute little sneaky face thank you thank you for that reese's well done we have also it's gonna take me because there's so many of them it's gonna take me a second so please bear with me um do 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 i'm completely lost here okay here we go boom lauren for these adorable fox cubs fox family so cute everybody in a big pile in the den adorable very nice so cutie patootie i'm going in all kinds of wrong order here because there's no particular order harsh thank you for this awesome sacrificial pumpkin it looks cool cool idea inside we like seeing it as pretty neat pretty neat we like seeing a pumpkin because you know halloween hey dig it we also have coral and serenade for their spooky spooky pumpkins very spooky well i mean this is a pumpkin house which is fun to see and it's a cool concept it walks intentionally that that space between pumpkin and house which we thought was pretty cool and this cool pumpkin face lumpy lumpy pumpkin face on the side which we totally dig and then let's see Reese's, Lauren, Harsh, Serenade, Coral, ah, and Eggy. Eggy, we thought this was great. We love seeing these lines at an angle. Weren't sure how we felt. Could not come to a consensus about half of a cub. I don't think 100% necessary, but overall the effect of this was really great. Thank you, Eggy. Another good build from you. Thanks, buddy. Uh, let's see. Third place is Quacko's Duck for the crazy, cool, strange pumpkin head design. This is totally unique. It is part pumpkin, part monster, and completely unexpected and weird. We were not sure exactly where this came from or what kind of thing this was, but we had also seen nothing like it. It's got, like... 
I don't know, weird tree parts or something. The face is awesome. The expression on it is cool. The concept is really unexpected and unique. The hands coming out all over, like it's coming out of the ground. It's got vines and vegetation spilling out of its mouth. And then a great sense of scale by giving us uh, the little actual pumpkins around. Scattered about was a really cool idea. Well done. Uh, second place, which looks like an astronaut helmet, but will turn into a gold block when I place it, is this. Clang is this awesome lion head. The only way this could have been better is if we would have had enough space for you to make the full lion. We see a lot of builds where we get the front half of a thing and then the back half of the thing is just left to just our own imagination. But instead of doing that uh, in an unconventional twist, Shore gave us almost two builds in one by giving us this awesome, crazy Viking skull, mohawk skull, pumpkin head thing in the back very cool and a really interesting touch the line i mean the line speaks for itself that it's just that's freaking awesome so well done and we thought that uh the best overall build in this build challenge as you may or may not have heard was geo's we felt it to be the most highly polished and fully realized concept out here um taking a cue from the savannah biome we have this uh red mesa i should say but uh, we have this uh, red sandstone elephants which just they look awesome and then the successful juxtaposition or setting against one another of the trees the size and scale of the trees really sink this into it's almost like a like a diorama it, it feels in a lot of ways like we're at the smithsonian and like this is the display that tells us about the elephants like it's it's that kind of a thing pretty awesome so well done geo congratulations everybody this was a lot of fun a lot of fun to judge so many awesome awesome builds everybody should be proud of the work they did here this day very nice wish we could give out more prizes but anyway well done again everybody and thank you for uh for your builds i had a good time bringing this to you uh, last but not least the player choice award goes to with six votes plot number 16 reese's the people love the orange snake reese's cleaning up with the hm and the player choice award i do love the oranges and i love that little snake very nice. The curl of the tree is nice, too. Well done, Reese's, and congratulations. Again, congratulations to everybody. Right now, the... Uh, what we got? Pixel Art Challenge is going on. Let's fly over there. Let's see. Speed. Why am I in caps? It's like I'm yelling. Speed. 10. Actually, I can do slash warp PAC and just be there. Boom. So the theme is the fall, not just fall, but the fall. Nothing to speak of yet. It just started. The post went up late, late last night. So there's still plenty of time to join and work throughout the weekend. So everybody's got extra time to complete it. Um, the fall, lots of ways to interpret it. What do you think, Slick? How are you feeling about the topic, the fall, for judging next week? Mm -hmm. The fall, what comes to mind? Well... It's getting really cold here in Pennsylvania. Yep. So something breezy. Mm. Leaves falling about everywhere. Breezy leaves Oh, maybe falling. a real leaf pile with someone disappearing okay. in it. Okay. Oh, yeah, jumping in a leaf pile. I haven't jumped into a leaf pile in years. Oh, God, that would be so fun. Oh, man, that would be fun. Walking through someone's yard and stepping in hidden dog poop under some leaves. Oh, man, nothing beats that sweet, sweet stink. Joking, that's disgusting. Slicks, you're nasty. Why has everything got to go to poop with you? I don't know. Why does it have to happen in my life? I don't know. Probably because you're a plumber. That stinks. <laughs> Disappointed sigh. Anyway. All right. So... That is it for this build challenge judging. Thank you guys so much for joining us. I really appreciate you guys taking a second to check this out. We had a good time bringing it to you. 
I hope you guys had a good time watching it with us. I have an idea for a new build challenge that takes place in the three block challenge plots. I don't know what to call it yet. <gasps> I'm trying to work out the finer points of it. Uh, let's see how we see how we're able to do it. If we can pull it off. If I don't think it's going to be fun, I'm not going to do it. Um, but it just it, it 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 appeared to me in a vision, as if in a dream. Anyway, we'll see. Look for that coming on the forums in the next couple of weeks. Um, something else I wanted to announce, but I can't think of it. Ah, keep an eye on the forums. Stuff is happening. There are things. So, anyway, that is it again for this three block challenge. Judging. Thank you to my sidekick Slick Seventy Seven. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. Thank you. Special thanks to Kissy, as always, for her full-on support and dedication to making sure that these build challenges go off without a hitch, signing you up for plots, those kinds of things. I appreciate you, Kissy. Thank you so much for your help. That is it for me for this build challenge judging. I will catch you guys next time. Zero Duke. And I'm out.